Hi guys, uh, for today's vlog, I thought I would do, I'm gonna turn down Sabrina the Teenage Witch here. Uh, just outside those doors, the delivery is here for the two chairs. So I'm really excited. I can't wait for you guys to see them. Hopefully I love them. Cause if I don't, I will be sending them back, but we'll see. All right, excuse the lighting and obviously, you know, the room isn't finished by any stretch of the means, but I really do, I love these chairs. I really love these chairs. They're so beautiful. Uh, for me, I, I will admit that I would cringe at the fact that it's not a direct match to the furniture. I but I but I'm trying to break out of my shell and not be so matchy matchy so hopefully by the time that I'm done with this entire room it will look good but this is a more French country style for sure not so much farmhouse but I feel like there's a little bit of a farmhouse element for me which is the back so I don't know you know exactly how the chairs are gonna go I don't know if they're gonna point in like they're doing or how I'm going to do this, but I knew that I wanted these two chairs on this side, and then my chair that I'll actually read in will be over there. Then, like I told you guys in a previous vlog, I still wanna do furniture here. I know it's gonna be like packed, but that's actually what I'm going for. I don't, I'm not going for minimalism by any means. I want this to be extra cozy. So I'm gonna do some sort of dresser there and then some wall art with book quotes and then i'm gonna need some type of ottoman and a rug i think also but i think i'm gonna go for a white rug that's gonna match this and then i'm gonna want i'm definitely gonna want another shelf i think that if i'm gonna turn this into a library i might as well make this wall look as much of a library wall as possible and I think to do that I need to make it like flush there and I definitely feel like there's a chance I could do curtains in this room but I don't know really that either there's so much about this that I don't that you know I'm still trying to figure out but just to give you guys a close-up on the chair sorry about the lighting it's really pretty and I did get these off of Amazon by the way, I'll link them down below. I believe I got the last two, so I think they're sold out, but I'll still link them when they come back in stock. They do have the matching ottomans, like the footstools, but I decided not to get them because I knew I was gonna do one big like ottoman. So I just thought there's just not gonna be enough space for all of that. I'm picking up this camera pretty late. It's seven o'clock. I'm making dinner over there. I'm actually making Alex chicken, which if you have been around for a while, then you haven't heard me say that in a really long time. I think the last time I made it was the last house. And we've got Hocus Pocus on in the background. My daughter is somewhere upstairs. I'm broiling vegetables and we're gonna have some rolls as well. But I'm just loving the library right now i just can't get over it and i actually found the furniture piece that will complete this space i haven't ordered it quite yet but i finally found it and i'm really happy and really excited about it 
But other than that, I really just haven't had much to vlog lately. I kind of actually have a little bit of a headache right now. There's the queen bee herself staring at me. She's waiting for me to say like keywords, you know, like this one or this one. But I'm not gonna say those words right now. And I wanted to show you guys that I started a puzzle. If you don't watch my videos on my main channel, I did a Dollar Tree haul. And I think this puzzle is so cute. So I decided to start it and I have the, the outline going. Just so that you guys can kind of see how big a 500 piece puzzle is from Dollar Tree. 